Megazyme provides an extensive range of assay kits for use in various assay formats, including auto-analyzer, microplate, and manual spectrophotometer. This L-lactic acid assay kit can be used to accurately measure L-lactic acid in various sample types throughout industries such as food, dairy, and beverages. This video tutorial will demonstrate the use of the assay kit with a wine sample using the manual spectrophotometer format. It is important to measure L-lactic acid in wine as it is mainly produced by bacteria during malolactic fermentation by conversion from malic acid and affects the overall taste of the wine. This kit contains sufficient reagents for either 50 or 100 manual assays and is supplied with a detailed data booklet. This assay is specific for the measurement of L-lactic acid. The principle of the enzymatic reaction involved in the measurement of L-lactic acid is shown in this figure. Measurement of L-lactic acid requires two enzymatic reactions. In the first reaction, in the presence of NAD, L-lactic acid is oxidized by L-lactate dehydrogenase to pyruvate. As the equilibrium of the first reaction favors L-lactic acid and NAD, a second reaction catalyzed by DGPT is required to drive the first reaction to completion. The amount of NADH formed in this coupled reaction is stoichiometric with the amount of L-lactic acid. It is the NADH which is measured by the increase in absorbance at 340 nanometers. Prior to sample analysis, the kit component should be prepared as described in the kit data booklet. And once prepared, they are ready for use in the manual assay procedure. All of the kit components except bottle 2 are used as supplied. The contents of bottle 2 are dissolved in 5.5 millilitres of distilled water. The bottle is capped and the contents are mixed thoroughly to ensure complete dissolution. Follow the manual assay procedure as described in the data booklet. Pipette all assay components except the final trigger enzyme in bottle 4 into each assay tube. A blank reaction and a standard reaction must be performed with each batch of samples. Pipette 1.5 millilitres of distilled water into all assay tubes. Pet 0.1 millilitres of sample to sample acid tubes. Pet 0.1 millilitres of distilled water into blank acid tube. Pet 0.1 millilitres of kit standard bottle 5 into standard acid tube. Pet 0.5 millilitres of solution 1 into all acid tubes. Pet 0.1 millilitres of solution 2 into all assay tubes. Swirl to mix the contents of bottle 3 prior to dispensing. Pipette 20 microlitres of suspension 3 into all assay tubes. When all of the components have been added, mix the tube contents thoroughly and incubate the tubes in the 37 degrees Celsius heating block for approximately 3 minutes. After 3 minutes record the first absorbance reading, A1, at 340 nanometers for all of the assay tubes. In this demonstration we are using the Megaquant Wave Spectrophotometer set to read at 340 nanometers. Alternatively, a recording spectrophotometer with 1 cm path length cuvettes can be used. Swirl to mix the contents of bottle 4 prior to dispensing.
After recording the A1 absorbance value, pipette 20 microliters of the trigger enzyme L-lactate dehydrogenase into all acid tubes. Mix the tubes thoroughly and incubate them at 37 degrees Celsius for 10 minutes to allow the reaction to go to completion. Record the absorbance reading A2 for all of the acid tubes. This absorbance reading completes the measurement of L-lactic acid. The absorbance readings A1 and A2 of the sample and the blank reactions are used to calculate the L-lactic acid concentrations in the original samples. When performing this test using the pre-installed protocol on the MegaQuant Wave spectrophotometer, the results will be automatically calculated and printed via the onboard printer, or the data can be exported to a computer using the SF Capture software. Please see our MegaQuant Wave video for further details. If the results output are raw absorbance values for both blank and samples, the calculations of L-lactic acid content can be performed manually as described in the calculation section of the kit booklet. Megazyme has also developed specific Excel-based MegaCalc applications for each Megazyme kit to allow quick and easy results analysis. Results can be analysed using the MegaCalc application specific to this L-lactic acid kit, which is available to download free of charge from the Megazyme website. The MegaCalc spreadsheet provides full instructions for use. Open the MegaCalc worksheet and input the following. Sample details. Absorbance readings for the blanks. For each sample, input the sample identifier and the absorbance values for the samples. Alter the sample volume if a volume other than the default 0.1 milliliters is used. If dilution of the sample has been performed, then input the dilution factor used. If no further dilution was performed, the dilution factor is 1. When all of the data has been entered, the concentration of L-lactic acid in the sample is automatically calculated and given as grams per litre in the original sample. For solid samples, input the concentration of the original sample extract in grams per litre. Concentration of L-lactic acid in the solid samples is then automatically calculated and provided as grams per 100 gram in the original sample. 